Hello guys and welcome to the first assignment challenge for this parkour fever. I think there's a total of nine challenges, so let's hope to complete them all. This is the closest one, and it's the first one, I think that's why they call it the first assignment. Make sure you use zip lines and slides to boost your player, makes your player faster. <coughs> Make sure you use this guide to your advantage because it can be very difficult if you're doing it on your own without any guides and then you have to look around more often. Try not to get caught like I did. <laughs> when you get caught, it doesn't get difficult, it just gets annoying that you feel like you have someone on your back and you have to do even more people. But um, try not to get caught. This should be fairly straightforward, but to be sure, if you're not very good at parkour yourself in this game, practice. Because if you don't practice, this will be very difficult for you. And you might have to replay like 10 times. That's just a rough estimate. So always use zip lines, they will help you get through places faster. And if you're, if this is one of your last trophies, if you're doing a for trophy, here's a zip line. If it's one of your last trophies, yeah, you should, you should do this as one of your last trophies, I mean. Because the story and the, and the side missions are more important. But if you want to do this at the start, it will, it will help you increase your agility and your survivor. Because I think you get 11.5k for survivor points. And you get 2k for the agility. But make sure you use this guide. Because you might forget, you might not see things like like this. I think because there's a total of nine. I think there's five on this map and four on the other map. I'm not, yeah, I think that's I think that's right. There's first assignment. There's end of tunnel. I forgot the rest of the names. It will be in the description below anyways, so it doesn't matter. Okay, there we've completed that. 2 minutes 9 seconds. We kind of messed up along the way, but we still got there in time. 2k agility points. That's very useful that is. And now we're going to go back home. So you, you 11.5k survival points, really good. Really good. If you're a beginner, and then you move like if you're like level one, you might move like three levels. I think. So that's really good. That is. Okay, we're gonna go check the map for some of the challenges. So here's the end of tunnel. Well, I mean first light. Sorry, that's the one we looked at. There's end of tunnel. First light. First Simon is the one that we've done. There's four others. But anyways, thank you very much for watching, have a good day.